Good morning, beloved of God. Shalom Alechem. Peace be unto you. It's my joy to have your space again on this platform, Destiny Voyagers. My name is Ebifawuku. Beloved, many people overestimate what they can do in a year and underestimate what they can do in a lifetime. That is why many people crash out in life. Failure, beloved, at a task may be the result of having tackled it at the wrong time. David suffered dearly for being at the wrong place at the wrong time. 2 Samuel chapter 12, verse 13. Beloved, time stays long enough for anyone who will use it. The trouble with life in a fast lane is that you get to the other end too soon. Don't pursue pleasure with such breathless haste that you hurry past it. Therefore, three things today. Number one, haste make waste. Ignorant zeal is worthless, the Bible says. People run their lives by their own stupidity. Proverbs chapter 19, 2 to 3, message version. Number two, give time time. Make the most of time. Ephesians chapter 5 verse 16. Number three, understand seasons. Ecclesiastes 3 verse 1 says, There is a time for everything, a season for every activity under the heavens. So, this morning I want us to sing this beautiful song, bringing in the sheaves, as we sing where our spirits be lifted. Sowing in the morning, sowing seeds of kindness, sowing in the noontide and the dewy eve, waiting for the harvest, and the time of reaping, we shall come rejoicing, bringing in the sheaves, bringing in the sheaves, bringing in the sheaves. We shall come rejoicing, bringing in the sheaves, bringing in the sheaves, bringing in the sheaves. We shall come rejoicing, bringing in the sheaves. Sowing in the sunshine, sowing in the shadows, fairy neither clouds nor winter's milling breeze. By and by the harvest and the labor ended, we shall come rejoicing, bringing in the sheaves, bringing in the sheaves, bringing in the sheaves. We shall come rejoicing, bringing in the sheaves, bringing in the sheaves. Bringing in the sheaves, we shall come rejoicing, bringing in the sheaves. Beloved, until I connect with you tomorrow, may all grace abound for you. In Jesus' mighty name, amen and amen.